Well, hello everyone. I'm back. It's just me. Um, of course, it's just me. Who the hell else would be here? I'm sorry. I'm I'm way out of it. Um, it's about 6:30. So it's weird. I swear we've been like we start busy and then get slow toward the end of the week, which is not usually how things go in pizza. But say lovey. Anywho, um. It's just gonna be a short one today because I'm gonna I'm gonna just rant for a bit while I go up here to Noodles and Company, which is fairly close. But I'm just in the mood for noodles for dinner, so that's what we're doing. Um and I don't really have a subject I want to talk about today. I just want to talk about kind of an interesting thing that happened to me this morning. I was kind of looking for other jobs, you know, because I've been thinking about this legal thing and so it's kind of just looking to see what, you know, what jobs are available if you're not a paralegal in law offices. And there are some, you know, there's legal secretary jobs and, and um, you know, just kind of that kind of stuff. And so that's a thing you can do. Um, and, you know, it's funny. I haven't worked in an office in so long that it thought of it. it sort of makes me weirdly anxious. And I don't know quite why that is. I'm not sure why, um, but it really does. It's just kind of like I, I think about it. It's kind of like I have this sort of weird, like, sort of ah kind of reaction, you know? Like, and I think it also it occurs to me that not having worked in an office for some time, um, it may be hard to get back in, you know? Because I mean, if I had, you know. 10, 15 years of office experience, whatever, you know, then they'd be saying, well, all right, then that's, then you've got that in your corner, at least, but I don't. Um, it's been a very long time, and, you know, there were things when I did work in an office, um, there were things about it that I enjoyed, um, and there were things about it that I didn't enjoy. It was hard in some ways. Um, you know, one of the things that's nice about delivering pizzas is that you spend a fairly significant amount of time just kind of driving around, which, by yourself, which, um, on the one hand, can be, can be dangerous, you know, being alone with your own thoughts for too long, but on the other hand, um, it can be kind of nice, because you're not, like, around other people all the time, and when you're in an office, you know, you're around other people all the time, and you have to kind of, I don't know, behave a certain way, and the other thing um, is, you know, what I was doing before when I was working in a mail room, there were kind of all these tasks I had to do throughout the day, there were sort of multiple things I had to do, you know, there was the shipping end and the receiving end, and usually there, you know, the mail distribution, of course, and there was, there was, you know, usually some kind of other facilities related thing I'd have to go do during the day, and, um, So the day kind of filled up, you know, and I was kind of, you know, I was out delivering mail or I was out on the receiving dock and I was back and forth between the shipping area and the receiving area. And, and um, so I didn't just sit, you know, it wasn't like I'm just sitting for eight hours. And um, I think it could be really hard to get used to, to just like sitting at a desk for eight hours a day every day. I don't know. I think that could be really difficult. Um, but... You know, it's a thing that um, I think I could learn to do. Um, but I always kind of made that point. You know, I just kind of thought that, you know, working in an office isn't everyone's goal, you know. And um, the problem is I, you know, it's like, well, okay, so what is? But, you know, ask me what is. That's, that's a tough question. But... Um, once I got there, once I actually was working in an office, it wasn't bad, you know? Um, there were definitely things about it that I enjoyed. And like I said, there were things about it that I didn't enjoy. It was, it's a very, um, I don't know, working in an office, it's a very controlled environment. You know, there's, there's certain behaviors that people expect. There's certain levels of dress that people expect. I, I got to wear jeans because I was working in the mail room, but most people in that office didn't. Most people wore slacks and you know, button-down shirts and stuff, and I kind of got away with being a little grungier because I was the male guy, um, 
Uh, we had to wear steel-toed shoes. Um, everybody who worked out on the receiving dock had to, had to do that. Um, and I'd get this horrible athlete's foot. It's kind of funny. I'd get this terrible athlete's foot. And, you know, athlete's foot likes um, hot and moist. So one, one of the ways you, you can sort of deal with it is just um, I'd get home at the end of the day and just take my shoes and socks off and keep my feet, you know, cold and dry. And that would, that would usually do the trick. Although it can take a couple of weeks. Um, so in the meantime, you just itch like mad. Um, yeah, working in an office is, um, it's kind of like school in that respect, I guess, in that it's, it's this kind of really tightly controlled um, environment, you know, and, and it isn't like being in a car all day or, or working in a pizza place. And not to say, I mean, obviously, you know, I mean, I'm wearing a uniform. I've got, you know, so, so in certain ways, yeah, what I do now is, is also very controlled. Um, it's just, it's a different environment. It's a different, um, you know, situation. And, um, if you were to ask me which one I prefer, I honestly think that in a lot of ways I prefer what I do now, but it's also not a job that's really going to go anywhere unless you want to go into management, and I don't. I just wonder how crowded all noodles and company is going to be. But anyway, um, so that's it, and that's just kind of what I've been thinking about today. Um, and it's something I'm going to have to deal with over this weekend, so I will not see you tomorrow because I'm going to be off, thank God. But I will see you Monday. So until then, have a good rest of your weekend.